As Schwartz goes forward, the missile stakes our feature today, group two. 1,200 metres, $2.50 about Schwartz. On the outside. They're set. And they're racing. The grey much, much better anticipated the start well with Semiana. Schwartz is just drifting back <coughs> as the face goes forward. Then came Steel City. And uh, she's an A-lister on the rails. Further back to Banju, Lock Eagle. Artic Glamour sits back last of all. The grey much, much better leads by two on the face. Semi on the third. Schwartz fourth the outside, no cover. Then Steel City from She's an A-list at Banju pulling. Lock Eagle three wide towards the rear. Artic Glamour sees them all. Much, much better at the 650. Two in front of the face, two off semi on. And Schwartz only four lengths off the lead in four. Then She's an A-list at Steel City. Banju under pressure from Lock Eagle. And Artic Glamour's got it all to do. Much, much better. Spins in front by two on the face. Then semi on traveling up well. Now Schwartz has popped the question and starting to put in good strides. Much, much better at the two. 25 led by two. Schwartz is closing in hard the outside and she's an A-list to making ground. Schwartz races up. She's an A-list to the inside. Schwartz a half in front to she's an A-list. Hardy glamour late. Schwartz begging for the post. Found it. Schwartz just won the missile stakes from the fast finishing Arctic Glamour and she's an A-list to third. Then much, much better Semion, Steel City, Lock Eagle running on. So did Banju and the face was last to finish. Wow, OK, so Schwartz puts his hand up as a real spring contender. He's an entire, remember, well-bred, raced by the Victorian Alliance, and they are looking for stallions, and that has just further enhanced his prospects of that. And note that only a couple of weeks ago, he was 101 in the Everest, 34 before the jump of this. I reckon he'll be looking for a slot in that big $20 million event in just a few weeks time that was a good performance and what a return from arctic glamour as well and she's an a-lister ran really well i think the first three were superb uh much much better just honest as always a million runs fifth but it's about schwartz isn't it and we've seen in the past him this guy be uh, proficient at say 1400 meters he'll run a really strong 1200 there's no denying uh, that he was probably uh left a little bit gasping for air late he was entitled to he was first up James McDonald gets a double. The O'Shea Charlton team get a double today, including a group two. So uh, that would be the first group win to Tom Charlton in partnership with John. Yeah, he's a lovely young man, is Tom Charlton. He does a really good job. He's been in Australia uh, for about five or six years now and he hasn't got any plans in leaving them. Why would you when you get to train horse flesh like this? So one of the key things with Schwartz going forward into this spring preparation is going to be dry ground. He doesn't like it.